Love and light, my soul tribe, all you beautiful cosmic surfers. Why are we here? As much and as far as I've seen and my understanding is, is basically we're here to exist. We're here to collect data for source in the hope that every possible piece of information it is collecting from splitting itself over multiple universes, dimensions, multiple beings, each of their experiences collected together will allow Source to rediscover where it is from and who created it, right? The best you can do, the truest you can do is to be true to you, to be you, to do you, not to conform, not to be any way other than who you are. It's going to sound weird, but if there's some people which enjoy being grumpy, right? That's true and right for them. For them to try to be happy and conform is not right. For you to be told something by a spiritual teacher which does not resonate with you, but you try to force it into your being and your understanding of life and existence, for you to feel that you should be that way is wrong. You should be the way which resonates with your true higher self. Whatever it is which you vibrate at most authentically is what you must be. Authenticity is the key. Be true to yourself before trying to fit in, before trying to conform, before trying to walk a certain path because others have done so and it has led them as far as they have gone. We are still here. We are still on this earthly plane. Perhaps even the greatest of gurus before us have only got as far as they have because they have continued to walk the path most trodden. Water will flow down the path of least resistance the least resistant path is the one already trodden. Again, going back to emotional responses, I saw it as a ball rolling down a hill. I used to respond to anger with anger. My ball would roll down that hill mindlessly in the track that it is worn into the hill. The path of least resistance. I was then mindful enough to catch the ball before it rolled tried stopping that energy. Don't be angry, stop it. I'm, I was with help, withholding that energy, with it, holding that energy in me, right? Stopping the flow of water, you become stagnant. Then I learn to redirect that energy, to catch the ball before it rolls, send it down a new path. And with enough time, this will then become the path of least resistance. This will become the go-to path, the natural response to any given circumstances can be redefined, rehardwired and relearned. I'm here to assist and help people relearn, help people discover the tools to allow themselves to relearn. Choosing that which benefits you the most, benefits humanity as a whole the most, but in key is the most authentic to you. The path of least resistance is to align vibrationally with who you are. Match it completely, integrate with it fully and just flow through life. Not trying to be any certain way to fit in, not trying to be any certain way to conform, not trying to be anything other than you are. Trying to be a certain way creates judgment within ourselves. I should be doing this. I should be at this stage. Why am I not good enough? That judgment we put upon ourselves only 
pushes us down. Accepting where we are, knowing that we're all individual, all on individual paths, all with individual experiences and lessons to learn, gathered together, that collective information will be returned and used for the greater good. Your mission, should you choose to accept it whilst here in Earth School, is to just be. Just exist. Be the greatest version of yourself possible by aligning with your higher self. Again, colour. If you're light yellow, be light yellow. Don't try and be blue. Don't try and be red. It's just going to make you feel messy, confused, and you're not going to shine bright. To be true to yourself, shine the brightest you can be, be proud, confident in yourself, be the colour you are. Not the colour somebody else wants you to be, not the colour you think you should be, because others are themselves. Be true to yourself, above all else. Another night, one and all, my beautiful cosmic surface. Namaste.